Hello, I'm Matthew Malcolm with Pacific Nut Producer Magazine, reporting to you from the annual conference of American pistachio growers uh, here in Palm Desert. Had a great lineup of speakers. They talked about how production and acreage continues to increase, and, and people are planting in soils that have never been planted in pistachios before. Some of these soils are you know, less than ideal with uh, saline conditions uh, in the soils and in the water that's being used. So. Now, Danielle here is an expert on water use efficiency and wanted to talk to you today based on your presentation. What recommendations you have for growers that are planting pistachios in these kind of soils? Yes, we are seeing an increase in acreage towards uh, areas that are uh, marginal soils. And uh, those soils were um, uh, basically uh, used for cotton production, and cotton production is declining. So pistachio is basically repla replacing cotton in all the western side of the San Joaquin Valley. And so we are uh, measuring the evapotranspiration of uh, pistachio grown on non-saline soil, saline soil, and saline sodic soil. Soil. And so we're noticing that as uh, the salinity of the soil increases, uh, the water used by pistachio orchard decreases by 20 to, to 40 percent. And so, but that doesn't mean necessarily that there's is less water used because growers have to put aside some of that water for leaching the soil. And those soils on are those soils are difficult to manage. Those are uh, low infiltration soils. And so, uh, what they should do is irrigate less over the crop season and irrigate uh, during the dormant season to leach the soil and to uh, maintain a good level of uh, a low level of salt for the following season. That's basically is what results out of our research study in the San Joaquin Valley. Great. Now, you know, uh, obviously pistachios can take a little bit more of that salinity than than almonds, for example. Yes. But you know, where where do you draw the line? We draw the line, we notice that pistachio is very tolerant to salinity up to a level of five to six decisiemens per meter in the soil, but it's not very tolerant to sodicity. So it's not tolerant to soil hypoxia and root asphyxia. And so whenever the soil has low infiltration and, and it keeps the moisture for longer time, that is where a pistachio is suffering a lot. And so uh, saline soil are pretty pretty okay for pistachio, but when the so salinity increases, also the sodium increases, and that sodium deflocculates the soil structure and prevents the water to infiltrate into the root zone, and so you get um, the, the plant of pistachio is not very tolerant to, um, to root asphyxia and root hypoxia in these conditions. Great. Hey, thank you so much for taking the time. Read more about these things in the coming issues of Pacific Nut Producer Magazine. And be sure to, to thank our sponsor for this video news, Jordy Nursery, for their support to the industry. I'm Matthew Malcolm, CaliforniaAgnet.com.